He's back, the sinister Scotsman Drew McIntyre returns at WWE Money in the Bank and he's got his sights set on the Intercontinental Championship. Welcome back guys to Fog Wrestling. Speaking of the Intercontinental Championship, let's just talk about the matter of fact that there was a title match tonight that means absolutely nothing. Nobody gave Ricochet a chance or Matt Riddle a chance, whatever his fucking name is. <laughs> and, um, it it could have been Ricochet, it could have been Riddle. It doesn't matter. Matter. Gunther's boring title reign continues. I am sick to death of Gunther. He gets the entrance with Ludwig Kaiser. The ring general, please everyone stay in a stand in attention for Gunther. And then he comes out, he has the match, he, he makes Matt Riddle tap out. Matt Riddle had his hair in braids and looked weird, but whatever. Uh, Gunther wins. Boring ass title reign continues. Nothing exciting about this. It's the same fucking thing. Oh, the ring is sacred, even though the other two guys in my team lose every week. So it's like, the ring's sacred, my ass. Uh, he beats Riddle. Then Drew comes out. Big pop for Drew, I guess. It hasn't been seen since WrestleMania. But he set his sights back to come back for the Intercontinental Championship. He hits Gunther with a Claymore. Watching this match. I felt like I'd been hit by a claymore. It's just very fucking boring. And anyone at this point who is denying that it's boring and that is claiming this gun for run is good, uh, you're lying to yourself. It really is that simple. Yep, you're lying to yourself. And I think the the whole excitement factor of it, when you know a guy cannot fucking lose, it, do, it does take away from stuff. No, I think he could lose against Drew, 100%. No, I think now he's finally got a challenger that could win. But just for, for the longest time, he's been taking on guys who just know that I haven't got a chance. Like Mustafa Ali. Yeah, but listen, right? I mean, we knew Mustafa. Drew, oh, Drew McIntyre comes back tonight. Should he not be saved for fucking, like, Rollins? Because he's going to feud for the world title? Know the fucking IC belt? Yeah, I get Oh, him. but that's where he... That was his last match at Mania for the... I don't get it. Oh, long-term booking. How's a, how's a long-term booking, right? The guy lost. He, he disappeared. He went home, cried like a little bitch, blacked out his Twitter. And now he's came back because there's All a right. pay-per-view in London and he wants to challenge for a mid-card title. Drew, there's, there's nothing long-term about that. Drew is a main offender by today's standards. But see, in the back in the day, who the, what main offender came back for the mid-card title? None. None? Like, fucking None. Like, what? I know, like, what the fuck? Like, and what is and again, like you said, I don't see all these main offenders in WWE that are above Drew. I don't see them. Yeah. So why is he going for the IC belt? Exactly. Is it because he's on SmackDown? Wait, is he on Raw? He's on Raw, so he should be going for fucking Rollins. Ah, well, I guess Gunther is on Raw. Anyway, who cares? It sucked. Gunther's reign continues. Drew McIntyre's back, that's guys. That makes Raw even worse, so you've got, you've got this IC belt that's held so above the US because of Gunther. Him and Rollins feel fucking... It, they, they both feel like... The, the belts feel like they're on a level playing field because this Intercontinental title reign's been going on for like a year and a half now. Gunther has got all these records. Gunther never loses. It be, Gunther does feel similar to Roman Reigns. Just a different belt. Yep. And not in the main offence. Hell yeah. And then you've got Seth Rollins. I mean, a, a guy that hadn't held a world title in over five years. He gets a brand new title that doesn't feel like a world title because... He beat AJ Styles to get it, let's be real. Exactly. And then, if, you could argue that this title is more prestigious, but that's not what they're going for. They're just going for, look, last time Drew was here, he lost to Gunther, so let's have him beat Gunther this time. Garbage, in my opinion, guys. Absolute garbage. Uh, Peter Few has been really, really poor so far, and I just don't see what's going to happen in the remainder of it to, to make, it any inter make it any better. Dom Dom's going to beat Cody. Anyway, guys, that's it. Let us know your thoughts on Drew's return. We'll catch you in the next one. Uh, pointless fucking waste of an IC title match tonight. We all knew Gunther was going to win, and surprise, surprise, he did win. Anyway, we're not winning. We're watching this, and it absolutely sucks. Catch you in the next one. Peace.